ladies and gentlemen, now joining us on the program. Are you ready for our first guest, Sunda? You are so excited. I am. He is so excited. He's so much. star. <laughs> I am. He's, he's the star of Plain Sight on the USA Network and was recently in Entourage. Please welcome Paul Ben Victor. <laughs> Give you a little hug and not, a not that I'm one to complain, <laughs> but I like the wire a lot too, oh, by the way. Just do I throw much. that out? Wire too, yes. Wire. In plain sight. Thank you, thank you, yes. Because the wire sight. taught me how to use drugs properly. <laughs> <laughs> and not get caught. This is true. It was like inf infotainment. It was infotainment. Yeah, it was All right. All right. How are you, sir? I'm good, I'm good. Forgive me for looking under your uh, chair. I was just checking out your leg. I know. I never okay? see. Yeah. You want to see my leg? You can I'm see sorry. Me. Nobody you, do? you fell on ice? I fell on ice. I fell, and he's been trying to push me I'm ever sorry. since. <laughs> and, now, and I've got a pump. i got to use this pump to fill up the air. And then I had to go through security, and they wanted me to take it off, but I can't because it's a cast. Right. Because you could be concealing. I could be concealing hair. Uh, hair, hair is more like it. It's more like it at this point. You don't even want to know. But I got to tell you what I thought was so funny yes. is that I told, you know, the executive producer Sue Katz called, and I said, oh, Paul Ben Victi's going to love us. I said, because... We did a movie together, and he didn't even remember us. I remember you. Is that hysterical? He didn't even remember us. From, no, he remembered it after seeing after us. After the fact, he, yeah. no, This is the funny part. He tells Sue, I don't watch that much TV. That's what he said. <laughs> He's on TV. He on TV. I watch nothing. You didn't even watch In Plain Sight? I watch a little bit of that. <laughs> I don't watch it. I have to learn lines. It takes me forever. My wife says she'll tell you. Do I watch any television? No. <laughs> Why look at her? Why would you watch television? <laughs> Give it up for the wife. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. What do I watch? I watch tennis. Yeah. I love the tennis and I love, uh, what else? No! <laughs> it's a Jewish man he can't remember. That's why I brought her here. So That's right. I answer and finish my set. <laughs> How do you always play like uh, an Italian? <laughs> It's <laughs> <laughs> a nose. My father's here too. You can look at his schnoz. We 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 have the big, tough nose. Well, yeah. you know. There's a fine line between the Jews and the Italians. Well, as far as features go. Yeah. So you know, but I play a lot of a lot of uh, Jews and Italians and and Russians and Greeks and. Puerto Ricans and Mexicans. You are a Puerto Rican, let me tell you. In Harlem, you be a Puerto Rican. That's right. Where's your flag? <laughs> Puerto Ricans love flags. They oh, don't know oh. that out here. Yeah. Yeah, well, yeah. It's that like. How do you do the Puerto Rican? You just put on a... I'm so important to the... What are you still? I forgot my line. <laughs> yeah, I just screwed it up. Take What's, his line? What's his line? What's his line? I'm so important to the Puerto Rican. I'm malo. Ah, malissimo. Oh, you know what that means? I see, I see, I see. Yo lo entiendo todo, man. Yo parezco uno Puerto Rico también. Qué buena, man. Mete de mano, man. Oi, baby. Now let's sing something. Now we'll break into the Shema. Out of anywhere. Pablo, let me ask you something. I don't know. I don't know. There you go. He's a good Jew. He's a good Jew. Yeah. <laughs> Great Jew. Jew. His mother would kill him. That's true. <laughs> His, His mother told here. him so. You know, my whole, I brought the entourage. The homeless book is here. The homeless book is here. You wrote a movie with your mother. What? You wrote a movie we with did. your mother. We did. We just, we just got, uh, we're in editing now. We just finished photography, Prince of Photography. It should have been Romeo. That's called, Romeo. So, which we co-wrote along with Michael Goldberg, wonderful writer, and um, uh, Greg Furkel, another writer. And your mother's name is Leah, just for everybody to know. It's Leah. <laughs> Am I right? That's a biblical name, isn't it? Yes, that's my mother-in-law's Hebrew name. <laughs> so I'm going to let you know. That's I can't one, forget. The one you love so much. I do love her. I do love her. She's but back to like your mother. 80. Yeah, she's you 80. It, you love her to death. No, no, she's not making movies. Believe me, she's, she's making lawsuits. Um, but the movie's done, right? It's in editing. We just finished it. Uh, it stars uh, Carol Kane and Kelly Osborne and Ed Asner plays my grandfather, and it's got an incredible cast: Michael Rapaport, lots of wonderful, terrific actors. Yeah. Now that's we just finished it. It's a, it's a sort of a Tootsie esque kind of story. It has a better kooky actor and his sort of middle age coming of age. Uh, I don't know. What else? Is <laughs> wife. 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 She's in it too. What else? My wife. She's in it too. She should be in it. Look at her. Put the camera on her. Is she beautiful? She, <laughs> she's got her own. She's got camera number six. 
She had camera number six. You camera on camera? She's smiling. Oh, it's on me. How did that happen? I'm so jealous. She's wearing those pretty shoes, and I can't wear shoes. I'm wearing an Ugg. She's wearing an Ugg, but her boot, her uh, boot cast was made by Prada. Is that right? I wish. I, if they did, we should do that, though, so I could look cute. Um, how is that? I mean, you know, I've always wanted to work. My, my dad was a musician, but I never had an opportunity to work with him. But having these a family that is in show business and working together, that's just so beautiful. It's got to be like such a great experience, man. Your mom writes, dad goes pictures, saw the book. I saw your, your sister, yeah. I saw her website. Your sister's an incredible textile artist. Yeah. And, uh, God, don't make me cry. Uh -huh. Why? What do you got? Working in a sweatshop? Why are you crying? Why would you cry? Why are you crying? Why are you making me cry? I just sit there and laugh. No, I get emotional when I talk about my family, but they're, they're very blessed. Everybody's very talented. My sister, my brother, has a book called Total Leadership that he wrote, and uh, he was at the White House last year promoting his, his work that he does at the Wharton School. My dad has a book out, so he, which we'll be talking about. I can't wait to talk about it, yeah, by the way. Yeah, it's very exciting. And my yeah. mom is here. She's, she's, a, an, uh, she's a bat mitzvah. She's a bat mitzvah. <laughs> when is that did, how you say it? Yeah, when? Yeah. When did you do it? Recently? She's about to. About to. Which I told the rabbi. Did you, you tell the rabbi? You did. I told the rabbi. Okay. Where are you, where, where are you doing it? In a little tiny exquisite shul in Greenport, Long Island. Oh, you go to Long She's Island. From Long Island. Island. I'm from Long Island. She's too. from Long Island. Makeup, Makeup artist from, 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 from Long Island. Island. <laughs> right. I have yeah. to do my bat mitzvah too. Where are you from? New York. You're from. New York. I'm from Brooklyn. From Flatbush. Yeah, we're just Flatbush. Right. Get up, blow dry. Use a new shampoo. <laughs> That's it. So, <laughs> so are you excited about this? Why do we do a blow dry? A thing I've ever done, and I've done a lot of work in my life, but this is another realm. I'm nervous. I would. I have to do mine also, and I'm. You know, I'm older, and so I, I just feel kind of embarrassed. Not embarrassed, but my Hebrew's terrible. You Don't know, worry I'm, about it. Really. <laughs> Study. Do a line. Ready? <laughs> yeah, it's your mother like your this. Do a, do a line from the half Torah. <laughs> One word. I can do the uh, Aaliyah when you're called up. Everybody could do that. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Leah. All right, please. Go to commercial. Here we go. Right, do we got to go to commercial? We do. Okay, we got to go to commercial, but when we come back, your dad's going to be here. Okay. Freeman, we're going to look at some of his... Uh, and he'll be nicer over. to your mother. And he'll be nicer yeah. to your mother. All right, so stick around. We'll be right back with Paul Ben Victor and his dad. Yeah. Stick around for more Paul Ben Victor and his mishpocha when we come back from Nashing.